about 1k away from the first turn point. I think Scott moved his but uh, this is where Owen said go so if anything goes wrong it's Owen's fault. <laughs> That's how it works. Watch what I'm doing here because um, it'd be very easy to 360 into the side of one of these trees which wouldn't be clever. Not at all. Back up to 4,000 feet now so that's handy. Uh, how far we're going away from the That's the turn point tag. Thank Christ for that, are we? That was one in a pretty tight turn. K mark, thousand feet to two and a half hours in the air. That's Carillavos reached, fifty eight K, two hours forty three, topping up uh, about four thousand eight hundred feet. I've doubled my height at three thousand feet, so uh, Slowing down, I'm going to get on the bar, push around the corner. So it's three hours into the flight, I'm in a, quite a weak climb on the Wimble Ridge, up to about oh, 5,800 feet, 65k cross country so far, excellent um, I've been on this ridge before last year and uh, it should be working. That sounds good, that sounds good. So, climbing up in very little. Um, got to 3800. What's the time? 332 into the flight. 3.46 in the afternoon, um, showing a 19k south southwest wind speed. I just need a little bit more, I think, to clear those trees on the opposite ridge. So, just staying here in, I don't know, zeros, halves, just uh, drifting ever so slightly. But, at least not in sync, so uh, good in that respect, but I can just do it going up a little bit more before I push on. Although Paranesti is right there in front and it's looking very attainable from here, um, especially if I pick anything up on the way. Uh, the climb has just run out, so yeah, let's go for it. 
Tesco. So it's not a very good place to be. It's quite low. I've got power lines down the down the hill a bit. But um, 2,000 feet still uh, climbing very very gradually. Um, I'm going to clear the lowest pylon. So I'm not worried about that. Just do with uh, getting a boost out of this valley. Cloud building quite nicely up on top. Just going to tease me and then dump me. going to work. I don't know. Down to well, 2 3, two, three ten. Not climbing much, not not losing height. Can't complain. 77k XC, three hours forty. So uh, all good, all good. It'd be a shame to ruin uh, it. So 80k on. I'm just teasing this little climb. It's barely there, but it's it's going up. Back up to 4,500 feet now. Nice and cool. Um, what are we, 3.53 into the flight? And it's... Uh, 5 past 4 by the look of it. So uh, I've got Owen on the radio, he's close by down below. Um, I should make gold from here easily, but um, if I can just tease this a little bit more, um, I should be able to beat yesterday's score. So. Uh, just hanging in, being as patient as I can, because the last thing I want to do is rush off and then uh, not see another climb. But yeah, goal is definitely in today. Fantastic. Change to right hand turns, give me arm a rest. Up to uh, 5,000 feet now, 4,000 above the ground. There's Paranesti below, just coming uh, around now. Easily into that. Uh, 80k, not making much difference at the moment, but uh, just trying to get to the top of this climb and uh, be patient. So, coming up all in uh, Paranesti. Made it uh, up to that cloud and down the hill, 700 metres away. Uh, 84 kilometres, 4 hours 5 minutes in the air. It's 20 past 4 on Saturday the 11th of September. And, uh, what a week, what a week. This has been brilliant. Uh, thanks to Owen at uh, Sky Gods. Um, oh, I love this place. Love it, love it, love it. 400 metres now to go. That big is the goal. Goal reached 84k. And I've got 2,500 feet across the ground. So I can see some clouds up here to my left. So I'm going to back up a bit and see if, uh, see if there's any rising air. Um, otherwise, it's a nice easy landing at uh, Paranesti. Go! So that's down below us, um, definitely landing now, 4 hours 16, uh, half 4 in the afternoon, 86k, just near Paradise. And uh, this should be perfect now. Like that. It's windy. Perfect. That's okay. Just easy, easy does it. Easy does it.